Today, we have a very special treat for you. It's Starbucks. If you are someone, you are that person who loves tinkering with your smartphone and unleashing its true potential, then you are in for the thrilling ride. And if you're not, that person who explodes his or her phone, I'm here to change that. Who are you? Welcome back to my YouTube channel where I explore this fascinating world of technology. Without wasting much time, let's dive in into Tamax. continue have you hit the like button subscribe to my channel and turn on post notifications so that you cannot miss this exclusive content like this one please do that thank you okay before we start go and grab your cup of coffee and get your phone ready because in this tutorial you are going to use your phone. So go and grab your cup of coffee and your phone and be ready. That's the only requirement that you need for this course. Okay? Alright. Before we start, what is Tamax? What is Tamax? My friend from my online friend will answer that for us. And will tell us what, and she will tell us what is Tamas. In fact, she is a he, it's she, not a he. So, what is Tamax, Elena? Termux is a powerful and versatile terminal emulator for Android devices, allowing users to bring the command line experience to their smartphones and tablets. It's like having a mini Linux environment right in the palm of your hand. With Termux, you can unleash the true potential of your Android device opening up a world of possibilities. Okay, Elena, can you please explain to us where can we get this Tamax tool? Where can we download it? How, and uh, where, which is the best place that we can get this Tamax tool, this Tamax app for Android devices so that we can use it to unleash, yeah, to explore our phone and see their potential? Because uh, that's what we are here for. Okay, Augustine. Termux app can be downloaded from GitHub, FDroid, and Google Play Store. I do highly recommend you download Termux from GitHub and FDroid because the one in GitHub have some technical problems. Once you install Termux from GitHub or FDroid, you gain access to a wide range of tools and utilities typically found in a Linux distribution. With a simple and intuitive interface, Termux lets you unleash the full potential of your Android device enabling you to perform tasks, automate processes, and explore the world of programming and scripting. In Tamax, you can execute various commands, just like in Linux. Either you want to navigate through directories, create new files, move files, edit those files, run scripts. Tamax allows you to do all that. And it also has a multitude of programming languages, such as Python, we have Pal, we have Go. So with Tamax, you can do anything that you want to do. It actually brings you the Linux environment to your Android phone. Remember these things you are doing, you are running them in your terminal. The terminal looks the same, exactly the same like that one in Linux. So with Tamax, everything is okay. If you have Tamax, you can learn programming. If you have Tamax, you can also learn some commands that are used in Linux-based machine using your Android phone, okay? Sorry, but I will have to interrupt. You have forgot one point. You can even access and control your device's hardware, making it an excellent tool for developers and enthusiasts alike. Thank you. I thought you will never say that. So there you, so there you have it. A very brief introduction to Tamax and uh, how and its user-friendly environment and uh, its vast areas that it has. Tamax open up 
a world of possibilities for everybody. Either you are a programmer, a developer, or you are a hacker, or somebody who loves to tinker with his uh, Android phone, then uh, Android, uh, then Tamax is here for you. You can use Tamax for educational purposes. You can use Tamax for your own uh, good reasons. Okay, so definitely, Tamax is worth exploring. Let's keep diving into Tamax tutorial for beginners. In our next episode, I will be showing you how to install Tamax and run some few commands. So make sure during uh, in our next episode you have a cup of coffee, you have an Android phone, and you are connected to the internet, so that uh, these things can run smoothly. Okay. Um, don't forget to subscribe, turn on post notification, and don't forget to like this video. Your support will help me a lot. Thank you for watching this video, and. Uh, have a lovely time as you continue with our episodes of Tamas Tutorial for Beginners. Also feel free to leave your question and comment down below. Let's keep, let's keep learning and pushing the boundaries of what Tamas can do with your Android device.